in the grass at the moment. Can you guess what this animal is? And I'm sure you've probably seen something at home that looks a little bit similar to this character. But this is a wildebeest or a gnu is another name that it's known by. And he is a big boy. He's a bull wildebeest. And he's probably sitting down because of all the rain that's come about. You know how you see at home when you're driving past the farm areas and you see all the cows sitting down on the ground? The animals out here will do the same thing before the rain. But you can see he's covered in mud. Look at all that mud on his hair, on his horns. He's been having a great time, obviously. And normally they cover themselves in dust and mud to try and keep nice and cool and also, well, to keep the parasites away. So there's lots of ticks and fleas and mites that are living on the various animals out here. But he's just relaxing. Ah, oh, look, there's some more well-spotted, Viem. Those antelope right at the back over there, those are called impala. And they are one of my favorite antelope, not because they are beautiful to look at, but because, and I hope that we get to see this, is that they are able to jump massive distances. They can leap a length at a full sprint of 10 meters. Can you imagine that? Running and jumping 10 meters? That's even, I think, longer than the Olympics long distance ju jumpers. Ow! <laughs> Look at him, he's pulling a funny face. Do you see that? He's sticking his tongue out at all of you, saying, nah, 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 nah. And that's a girl. So as we look at these impala, Okay, see, look at this one, another one. My goodness, look at all the most amazing animals that we've got here. This is called an Inyala. So now I hope you're thinking of questions for the wildebeest, for the impala, and for the Inyala. This is a boy Inyala. And we're going to sit here, and I look forward to hearing from all of you soon. But let's go back across onto Byron's vehicle, because, well, to be able to see ground hornbills on screen is pretty amazing. <laughs> 